Thank you, Rob. This morning, investigators are still looking into what caused a deadly trench collapse in Huntsville. It happened at a construction site near Joe Davis Stadium. The 15 deep foot deep trench caved in and trapped three Huntsville Public Works employees, killing one of those workers. Way 31's Olivia Schuler is live where the collapse happened. Olivia, what do we know so far about this investigation and the victim? Well, Megan, the city of Huntsville is mourning the loss this morning of 55 year old Bobby Green. Green headed into work like any normal work day, not knowing that day would turn deadly. Huntsville Fire and Rescue responded in just minutes to a 911 call just before 1 p.m. At the scene, three public work employees were found trapped after installing storm pipes 15 feet below ground. The fire chief at Huntsville Fire and Rescue saying they knew there was a high probability that they were dealing with a fatality when responding. Our heart, our heart and prayer goes out to them. Our heart and prayer goes out to them. You know, when you have trench collapses, there's just not a lot of telltale signs to say everything looks really good, then all of a sudden it's not. The two other Huntsville Public Work employees are being treated for non-life-threatening injuries. Today, authorities will continue to look into what led to this deadly trench collapse. Now, McFarland said it is a good thing that the city hasn't had to deal with other collapses, especially as the city continues to grow and more construction takes place. Reporting live in Huntsville, Olivia Schuler, Way 31 News. Thank you, Olivia. Huntsville Fire and Rescue led the rescue operation with help from HBD, Hemsey, and even a heavy rescue unit from Madison Fire and Rescue.